Golden City Labyrinth, and it's really kind of an homage to the city of Prague. I guess anybody who's ever visited Prague just falls in love with the city, the, the golden profile of the building is actually the building across the street, kind of reflected in this labyrinth. This one, uh, this labyrinth is, is, is smaller, it's made completely of paper, so it's really much closer to the most literal interpretation of the labyrinth and its history with the red thread of Ariadne leading you know, out of the circuit of the labyrinth. And this panel has the path. So this is also gold leaf that I applied to paper, and then I tore it. So it's all torn paper, and I actually kind of blocked the labyrinth with my fingers by tearing the paper and just making the spiral walk inwards and then making the walk labyrinths on, on the glue are also done by um, gluing the paper. I mean, all of my work is really based on, on collage and sort of the concept and the technique of collage and assembly. And then the other gold around here, that's actually gold dust that you can really just blow it and it just kind of falls wherever. This series of labyrinths on, on the wall, these are actually all done on silk. So this is um, uh, silk organza that also has metallic threads in contrast between the metal on the very fragile silk. And I just tear the silk and there are you no know, threads and things hanging down. It's so very much about the edges in the same way that I tear. And this one I made specifically for this window. I liked this the layers of the grid on the outside, the different layers of the window frame that I worked on, sort of the idea of the fragment and the overview of the a walk of the labyrinth, like you could put on these shoes and walk out of the window or walk the labyrinth of the